Hey guys, it's Adam AK Swimming Bird. Welcome back for some more Animal Crossing New Leaf. Yes, my hibiscuses, hibiscus, whatever, <laughs> are growing. And uh, it's a beautiful Sunday morning here. And it's raining yet again. This is definitely a fake rock. Let's grab this amethyst. And uh, I think Josh was looking for amethyst. I might save that for him. Um, I need to find Joan before it gets too late. I'm actually running out of time to get some turnips. So I should keep a lookout for her. Uh, I didn't get a message when I started that Shampoodle had finished uh, being constructed, so we might not be able to do that today. How's it going, Brofina? Let's start a rainy day with the grumpiest villager. Good morning, Adam. Is it going to rain all day? I may as well just stay inside, Adam. Was there something you wanted, Krakya? Let's chat. So, Adam, I'm feeling like a quick game of hide-and-seek. How about it, Krakya? Sure, let's do it. That's a good way to start things off. And waste my half hour before I can get turnips. Uh, <laughs> my last half hour to get turnips. Well then, let's round up a few others and meet in the event plaza. Fuck yeah. This won't take that much time. Alright, so we're looking for Pinky and Graham. Guys, Tangy is right over there. You think we should invite her? Or? I guess not. Okay. Pinky should be really easy to find because she's huge. And she's a bear. Let's put my shovel away. Alright. Oops. Oh, come on. <laughs> she didn't even try. <laughs> <laughs> she she kind of she was behind the rock, but like that was the worst. Come on. Uh oh, there's Joan. I could actually talk to her right now, but that would be oh okay, Pinky. Pretty bad spot too. No no no. Well, you got me fair and square, Smoopy. Wow, I thought I was totally seek proof lump off. Well, there's one more left to find, Smoopy. Good luck. Stop calling me Smoopy. <laughs> I don't really mind that much. Uh, okay, so Graham is going to be harder to find, most likely, because he is tiny, and he can fit into all the spaces, if you know what I mean. No. Um, pitfall? Nope. I probably shouldn't be walking over pitfalls purposely, purposefully, if, uh, if we're playing hide-and-seek or whatever, but... I, I learned today that if, if your town tree gets fully grown, or most of the way grown, you can actually sit uh, under it. I'm not sure if it does much. No four-leaf clover for me. I bet Graham is up in the uh, in the upper areas. I just don't want to. I'll just I'll just take my time and pull weeds. I don't want to run on the grass, obviously. I need to start setting up. Oh, there he is, you little bugger. Ah, you found me. You must have cheated. No wait, I meant that is a compliment, Adam. Uh, I gotta start planning maybe a path around the town eventually here, but I'm not too worried about that. A polka dot sofa. That's what I always wanted. <laughs> Alright, thanks, Grafina. I, I still found a... Oh, jeez. The deafening sound of umbrellas. Hey, Adam, I feel like we need more dancing happening right now. Okay, that's a little better. <laughs> what a weird... <laughs> uh, so sleepy. I was up way too late last night, working on a special note for a special someone. To whom? Well, that doesn't matter. I might never send it. The point is I ran out of juice. I zonked out. I mean, I'm sure I could get my pet back if I had fruit. How about that? Give me a piece. One piece, sure. Well, really, you'll save it for, or get it for me. Oh, I, I can't wait to save the results. Out. Do I already have? Oh, nope. I thought I might have had a pear on me, but I was gonna talk to some people. But I should probably go talk to Joan before she gets too far. Ugh! Should get over this rain already. Seems like I just need to deal a buff. What's up? What? <laughs> I've been wondering what you've been doing with your place lately, Snoopy. I'd love to come check it out today. How about it? Sure. I'm busy. Okay. They always want to. It's always like an hour or like 45 minutes or so after whatever time you talk to them. I'll try to remember Pinky, but I usually forget before. Like, I'll record for a bit and then I'll forget by the time the villagers are over there. Joan was here. Here she is. I actually don't have that many bells on me. Hmm. I might actually go get some money out. Oh, 110. That's pretty expensive. I don't know, Joan. Maybe I'll skip turnips this week. I don't have them. I, ooh! It's just balloon furniture, but I still get excited. I really wish they would uh, have something else in the presents. People were like, maybe Nintendo will do DLC to change the. to like add random furniture again, but I don't know if they'd ever do that. It's, it, the balloon furniture can be cool, but it would just be nice if there was like some variety. And we got a balloon dog lamp, another one. I've already got one of those. Let me get my slingshot off here. Okay, so what should we... Oh, I know what we can do today. Other than a public works project, I need to start another one of those. Um, 
we can head in and go see the museum exhibit. I think we should start with the public works project, though. What do you guys think? Since we're over here already, and I, I'll, going through the shops will take a little while, let's head over to Town Hall. Um, I'm not sure what I want to start, because uh, we got the museum one done. That was the like big important one that I wanted to do. But I can't think of uh, what other one. Like, some of the others, like the lighthouse and the dream suite and stuff, that would be cool, but... It's a lot of money. Maybe I'll do the Dream Suite. Then that way I can visit some of the towns and stuff and, and check out other, you know, other people's things, steal their patterns, that sort of thing. Oh, Mayor, I just remembered. The towns were like a, oh. Oh, really? We're gonna go to the museum? Okay. Let's do it. I'm happy to, since it's such a big project. I think I'll go with with that. Like, if it's a big thing, I'll do the, the little presentation, or the celebrations. If it's smaller, I might not. <gasps> Oh, we're at the train station. Weird. Okay. <clears throat> Hello, everyone. Celeste is here, though. Welcome to the grand completion ceremony for Gustin's Vital Museum re Renovation Project. Thank you for joining us on this momento occasion. Yep, yep, yep. Only Tangy and Cranston came out, and they could use their umbrellas if they wanted, but I guess they choose not to. Alright. We have an incredibly short speech from me. On to the next project. Dang. I'm so cool. I don't even have shoes on. That's how cold I am. Alright, just <laughs> let's get on our little poppers. It's always the same, but it'll be cute to see Celeste do it. Oh, she's just staring. Oh, okay, she cla She rubbed her belly. I thought she was going to do the popper, but she didn't even bother. Jeez. She's kind of like stood there blankly staring. <laughs> Alright, well that's done. Next we, uh, whoa, Cranston's always so happy to see me. Oh good, I've been looking for you, Schmoopy. Baby cakes. <laughs> This is bad, Schmoopy. I got a package that was meant for Nan. I really want to open it and see what's inside, but that would be so wrong. You have to help me resist the temptation to snoop, Schmoopy. Will you please take this package, <laughs> Snoopy? Uh, yep, sure, I'll do it. Alright. Thank you. Tangy, what are you up to? Not playing hide-and-seek with us, that's what. Okay. Let's. I'll just check if Nan is home. If not, we're going back down to the town hall. Man, they distracted me. We're supposed to start another public works project. Huh? A snail! Two snails! Sweet, my bushes haven't even grown really, and, and there's already snails on them. That's what I. That's kind of the main reason I wanted to make a bush, even though they look nice too. But I need to get a snail, and I don't. Obviously, I don't have one yet because it said I need to check out my encyclopedia. Double the snails. I don't know if they only come out when it's raining, but that seemed like pretty good timing. Is Nan about? Yes, she is. Uh, I, I can't remember if I've seen her house before. You guys might remember better than I, or when I see it, I'll be able to tell. Huh. Yeah, I don't, I don't think I've been in here before. She's got the trash can she bought from me. Oh, you can throw stuff away in the trash can? Sweet. I didn't know that. Can I play the piano while I'm sitting on it? Nope. Oh. <laughs> let's, let's talk to Nan real quick. She's got some nice stuff in here. Uh, well, well, if it doesn't add them. Thanks for coming to visit me this morning, body. <laughs> she says body. So what can I do for you? That's what I, I get for that catchphrase, of course. Uh, <laughs> now what could this be? It's a green wrapped present. They always use the same ribbon for their presents. Every villager loves to use that green wrapping paper or green ribbon. What could it be? Mm -hmm. Chat, I totally forgot about that and I bought myself a new one. Well, are you curious about what's inside the package? Hmm. Alright, it's only a thousand. I guess I'll take a shot. I'm just gonna buy the package and I gotta see. She already has one? There you go. I actually haven't seen them do that before, where they just sell it back. Anyways, please get my grads to Cranston. Let's see what's in this package. It's a now it's red, because I can open it. Weird. That's not a villager thing. A wh ooh, white pot. That sounds a little... Keke etude. Whatever that one's called. This desk is really good. And this chair. This would be really nice for my mayor's office. Let's see if there's anything in here real quick. A freezer. <laughs> How'd you keep that in there? Well, that's where it was. I knew my freezer was around here somewhere. Well, since I've lived so long without it and I don't really have any room, would you like to have it? Yes, please. That sounds pretty cool. That's great. And I'll have more storage space. I could put it in a basement eventually. Because that's where you gotta keep them freezers. What is it? That's a nice clock. I'll click it. No. Okay. Anyways, I got distracted again from the Public Works Project. Alright, let's go and get that done, and then I'll show you guys the, uh, the museum exhibit. And 
then and then we'll be done. I'll pr I'll go through the shops a bit, but I don't I don't want to spend too long. Uh, we've already spent a lot of time playing hide and seek and getting the uh, the old run around from the villagers here. All right, what can we build today? Now that we've completed, she like ditched me at the train station. Come on, Isabel, hustle that cute little butt over. <laughs> All right, public works projects. Let's see, start a new project. All right, dream suite. Let's go through these. I don't think there's anything too new. Oh, there's a modern bench. I don't remember. I think someone requested that. It's a bit more expensive than the yellow bench. Well, fountain. I want to. I might wait for like a cool. Ooh, I don't really like the modern street light that much. The street, the older street lamp is cooler looking. I think. I kind of like more, you know, rustic or classic designs. The chair sculpture is so weird. Maybe I'll just go for the dream suite. I like that modern bench. The dream suite is pretty good. I mean, I can use it to, you know, see other people's towns easy. So let's do it. So I think I have to go, yep, the train station. All right, that's it. Thank you. So uh, I can ask her how the town's doing. Not that I need to kill time or anything. We've already got a fully loaded episode today. But let's see. How's the town doing? I haven't asked. Citizen satisfaction. You want to know how? Yep. Sure thing. Oh, yes, it really was a wonderful feeling, but perhaps, well, it's also lacking just a little something. Hmm. Could still be improved, but it's a good place to look. Oh, only a little work. I couldn't tell who was saying that, because sometimes you can tell, like, who submitted their anonymous thing, because they'll, they'll write their little baby cakes or whatever, their catchphrase into it. <laughs> like, I think one was Blathers before. But anyways, okay. So we're going to head up, and I'll show you guys my little museum exhibit I started. And, uh, head to the shops. Excuse me, Tangy. I might as well talk to her. How you doing? You don't like this rain, do you, Adam? I can't stand this stuff, sweatband. What's up? What's the latest? My home is so stuck in the past, I can't stand my interior design. I need to stir things up. My lacy parasol could be replaced. But I'll have to swap it out with something the same size. That's what I gave you! That was for your birthday. Ah, the tears will... <laughs> the rain will hide my tears. <laughs> They always want to get rid of something that I gave them, because they're like, hey, this doesn't fit in the town. It's a little too early for me to go into Club KK, but, oh, okay, so they're still working on Shampoodle. That's what's going on. Well, I'll start by going to the museum exhibit to show you guys, and then we'll do some shopping. That way you can, you know, you know, get to see the new stuff. Well, it's all new stuff, but this is something I haven't shown yet. I even did a little picture display. One of the pictures in my house thought I thought it would be great. For there. Oh, I have one of these already, but I could buy another. <gasps> a silver shovel! Sweet! I want this. I want these. <laughs> oh, dear me. I, I beg your pardon. I was just resting my eyes. So, um, yep. I'm gonna buy that. Give me it. Give me it. Give me it. So, only, only 15 fossils is all it takes to get the silver shovel. What is this wallpaper? If I don't talk to her soon enough, she'll fall back asleep. A museum wall? I'll take it. I don't know if what it looks like, but I'll take it. And then what do we got here? I think I have one of these already, but might as well buy another. I can use it. Thank you. Just buying everything. So on the on the side here, we have our first exhibit. This is the Ninty Land exhibit by Adam. Nope, I'm not going to do anything. That's got the... It's uh, Womp's Castle from Super Mario 64. The little picture there. I think it looks really good with the reflecty glass look over it and stuff. But uh, in here, I've been depositing a lot of my Mario and, well, generally Mario, just because there's a lot of those, but Nintendo-themed items. Got my card in here. Bloop. Everything going on. I can turn this on. But it clashes with the music. I think I can put a music player in here and play different music, so I might do that eventually when I have more KK Slider music. But yeah, that's my first one going. It's freed up a ton of room in my storage, so I'm really glad that I can do something with these Nintendo items. So I bought everything there, and we're going to head over to the shops, and hopefully I still have room in my inventory to do anything. What if I wave at Blathers while he's asleep? Will he see me? Nope. <laughs> he's just like, whatevs. Go cough up an owl pellet, you little boyd. Alright, let's go. Head over. I don't know why it's, I've insulted him. Let's head to the Ables first. Lots of stuff going on here. The paint fumes are seeping down. And they've killed the hedgehogs. 
How's it going? Oh, Mira's here. I gotta get ready for Mira's birthday eventually. Gotta make sure I have something good for her. What are these? This is like a Cleopatra of Pharaoh's outfit. That would be good with the helmet that I kept not buying. Like a zebra skirt. Some gray striped pants. These look like a, like a lady's like workout pants or something. Or sleepy pants. Nah, no thank you. I'm gonna stick with my, my dragon clothes for now. How are you doing? Making some armor? She's gonna talk about it raining again. Tee hee hee, what might she be shopping for today? Oh, if you're looking to do some clothes shopping, just let me know. She did say something different even though it was raining. What's up, Mira? Oh, shit! <laughs> Crazy meeting you here, Cotton. I spelled that with a lowercase l instead of an i, so it didn't say it was an offensive word, but I forgot I gave her that greeting. So is there something you need from me? Nothing. <laughs> I want to chat. Kind of gloomy weather, weather, right? I'm thinking maybe some new clothes will cheer me up, Cottontail. Jeez. Ugh. Sorry about that guy. <laughs> I forgot I gave her that. What is... Is that a terry cloth do-rag? We got a lot of stuff I already have, except for this army helmet. It's a combat helmet. That's pretty cool. I'll grab that. I'll dress up like a soldier. Thank you. Let's try it on real quick, since I don't have any... Uh, thing on my head. I'll just wear it for now. Looks pretty. Looks alright. It's got like a little grass on it. Is this like a pink paw? It's a paw umbrella. It's pretty cute. Anyways, okay, heading on to the next shop. Speed things up. Don't want to go too long here. But yeah, things are going alright. I'm guessing Shampoodle will be open tomorrow, unless it takes as long as Kicks over there. But uh, I'll have to check. I keep forgetting to try to catch the birds. I got my silver shovel though. Okay, so I can get rid of my old shovel. And uh, I think it gives you a chance that the rock, the bell rock will hit ore, or drop ore out of it. What is this? An oil lamp. That's interesting. I'll grab it. I feel like I'm going to run out of room in my inventory. Is that a fake tree? It's really cool. Gotta get that. Gotta get that. A tree standy. And then there's a TV. And that's going to fill up my inventory. So I need to throw some stuff in. Any good wallpaper? A tent wall. Let's try that out. Hmm. It's okay. That would be good with my bizarre music. I might get that to put the gyroid, because I'm going to make an, another exhibit for gyroids pretty soon here. Let's throw some stuff in, in my little things here. I'll throw my shovel up there. Alright. So I might get this, mu this uh, tent wall, because I think that would be good for the gyroid museum that I'm going to make. And then what else do we got here? This TV is pretty cool. I don't have a TV, so I'll grab this widescreen. Thank you. I'm almost out of money. It's because most of it's in the bank to collect interest. And what is this? Checkered tile. All right, I think... Oh, wait, we're going to... We got to do the fortune. That's nice. I like that. I'm buying way too much stuff. I've almost exhausted all my money. We got to do the fortune cookies, and then I'll get going. If I get anything cool at kicks, I'll show you guys later. Um, but yeah, for, for now... I'm probably just gonna end with the fortune cookies here, since we've had a long day already. Lots of playing around with animals and that type of stuff. Again, let me know if you have any ideas for museum exhibits. I'll probably use at least one for gyroids. I saw a cool design to as it was like a gyroid museum, but it used all four of the exhibits to put one of every gyroid in there. She wears armor today. She wears armor tomorrow. That's probably a Varia suit thing. Um. But yeah, it, it had paths so you could touch all the gyroids, that sounds weird, and put music and stuff with them. What? The, I got the exact same one. That's weird. Um, but it took up all four slots, so I probably won't do that. I'll probably just keep my favorite gyroids, you know, put them in, put them in my house, and then whatever else I'll try to put in the museum. But, but you know, if there's too many, I might have to get rid of some. Because I want to use, you know, each one for a different thing. Man, I have I think I have three Varia suits now. So, uh, got ample of those in case I ever go up against any space pirates. Anyways, thanks for watching, guys. Let me know if you, uh, know, have any suggestions for, for what you'd like to see me do here. Once the Dream Suite's built, I can go visit other towns and stuff, so that's exciting to look forward to. But tomorrow we should have Shampoodle, and, uh, I'll see you guys then. Leave a like if you enjoyed this, and, uh, see you next time for more Animal Crossing New Leaf. Goodbye, soldier. What's up, Shrunk? Oh, we're not open for the day yet. Is there something you need?
brought a snack, up, buddy. It's the same thing from yesterday, but... Oh, really? That makes me so happy. What'd you bring me? Just a pear. But, uh... I think this will be... I think you'll find that this is... <laughs> I love that... Have you ever seen that little... The email where the guy was supposed to pay, like, the bill, and then he paid with the drawing of a spider? And he's like, I think you'll find this is efficient, or <laughs> sufficient to, uh, to settle things. Thank you, thank you. Dr. Shrunk is in the house. My distress joke is just the thing to cure what ails you. So, uh, the other day I was at a birthday party for my wife. Congrats! I feel like such a lucky guy of all the fish in the sea, I told I caught a whale. That's what I said to her. And then she made this really angry face and glared at me. I'm never talking to you again. What? Why would she do that? Well, did I say something wrong? I thought that was a compliment. Oh. Waggity, smaggity, doo. 